what's up guys i thank you very much for being an electrica i really appreciate that now i have a charger uh, before me with these batteries now we want to learn how we are able to connect this charger to these batteries so that they can get charged okay now you can charge these batteries in two way uh, one you can charge them in series or in parallel okay but now that will depend on the type of configuration of your system. Probably you have a system of having two batteries of 12 volts or three batteries like this one of 12 volts. Okay? And you have configured them in parallel. All right? Or in series. So how do you, you know, charge them if they are in the system? So that's what we are learning today. Now, uh, let me show you. Uh, this is a Start 560 charger. Uh, this charger, uh, let's understand it first. It can charge up to six batteries. Okay? Then it has two voltages, uh, 12 and 24. Okay? That's, those are the things that you have to check on the, on the chargers. Secondly, it has this knob here, so it can help you to do quick charge if you just need a boost on the battery you can set uh here seconds up to 90 seconds okay to boost on your your, your battery okay uh here you have a number of batteries so if you're charging one battery you can uh, uh select one two three four five it depends on the number of batteries that you have okay that's one. So it has a meter here which will show you the output current, okay, that your batteries are drawing at a time, okay? Now it has two leads. You have this lead here that is the positive, which is connected to either of the terminals, okay? You can, it can be 12 or 24, and then the other one is coming from inside, which is the negative, okay? So here we are back to our batteries. Now, one thing you have to know in the previous video, link in the description, uh, when you connect batteries in parallel, you increase, you know, the capacity of the battery, okay? Now, these are three batteries, each is 100 ampere hours uh, and 12 volts, okay? So if you want to connect these batteries in parallel and we want to charge them in parallel, what do we do? So... So first of all, pyro, like the way uh, we saw last time, we'll have our positive to the positive, okay? And then we have another positive. To our positive. So all these terminals here are positive. All these terminals here a negative so okay now once again we go to the negative side we connect like that then lastly we will connect to the last one so these batteries are connected in a parallel, okay? We did that in a previous video. Now, if we want to charge these batteries, you have your positive. Because the system is 12 volts, it is in a parallel and the system is 12 volts. So here, our charger is on 12 volts terminal, okay? And we will get this, okay? and we'll connect it there, and then the negative, which also connects to the negative, okay? So, so it's on, what we're going to do, because we have three batteries, so we'll have to select three. Okay, so three batteries here. Now, 
That's where you have to be very, 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 very careful, okay? So now, the battery can charge in parallel, all right? Okay. Now it's off. And we've unplugged it, okay? So, what if these batteries, they were connected in series? in the configuration, how do you charge them, okay? So, we will disconnect carefully. Now, the difference here uh, with series we, we cannot connect three batteries in series because our charger, it can only take only two, which is 24, because we, we can only charge with the 12 and the 24 volts. If we add three batteries uh, in series, that will be 12 times uh, three, okay? So that's gonna, uh, that will have been a lot, okay? So our charger won't support it. So what we are going to do, we will only take two batteries. So for this one, we will only, uh, you know the series, you have to connect. So we can swap these like this so that we match uh, positive, negative, uh, positive, negative. So what we're going to do is to connect here positive to negative. Now, we have one battery here, which is 24 volts, 100 ampere hours. Now, when you want to charge this one, so we have to disconnect this from 12. To 24 so I've moved from 12 to 24 volts okay okay so same thing now this is obvious positive to positive and negative to negative okay and uh, will battery charge okay so we connect two of them, okay? So you see, you are able to see those sparks. So the batteries charges very well, okay? So I hope you understood that. Next time, one, you have to check your charger to see uh, how your charger charges, in which configuration. If it only 12 volts, then you cannot charge it with 24, okay? All right? Uh, and also, if you're charging, uh, if you're charging the uh, in parallel, also you have to know how man, how many uh, batteries that your charger can charge. Okay. All right. Uh, thank you very much uh, for watching and for being on Electrica. I appreciate that. If you're new here, please feel free to subscribe, to like, and share. And sharing, of course, to the people whom you think that this kind of content uh, work for them, okay? Then the other thing also, uh, we're going to have a little bit of changes. We'll blend in some, you know, uh, some contents, uh, something to do with the generators. So that's why we are doing uh, these batteries. So we'll be doing stuff like... Uh, uh, most of the stuff as far as the engine is concerned, okay? So you'll be always refer to some of these earlier videos. So until next time, I'm out.